It's one of the very few sports, if not the only sport, that there are no different rules for men or women. The field's the same size, the ball's the same size, the game's the same length. I love being able to participate in something that I guess in my way feels like a little bit of giving back or paying forward. We had 40 to 60 of the young women come out every day. At this point they didn't have any opportunities for sports teams and we went in and did a session, two sessions a day for about five to seven days and the president of that university came and met us at the airport to say she's now instituting a women's college soccer team, which was amazing. I believe the Chinese government, and they might have moved forward by now, was looking to bring soccer into all the schools as youth sports. So having a chance to maybe showcase why that would be fun. And I said, if they do that, our U.S. women's national team could be in trouble because they will have a big head start on getting these young players at a very young age to, to start competing with us. I think sports can open up lines of communication and levels of human understand in a way that you just don't get when there's political agendas. It is hard sometimes when you see the global landscape at times and and then you do these kinds of trips where you're like it's so easy to get along and have fun and see some common ground even though we might come from different places in the end we have a lot more in common than we ever do at odds with each other. Thank you.